It's an inside job. That's what it is. Don't try to fix things on the other world outside. Learn to be quiet. The Buddha is within yourself. Don't look for it anywhere else. Because the majority of the world is in ignorance. You can't ask them to bring you peace because they don't they have been founded inside themselves. They don't know where it is. The authorities, the government, people around around you they haven't found it inside themselves you have you you have so just bring your attention to that place and stay spend more time now than before in meditation sit quietly still somewhere go in the nature spend time by yourself stay in meditation All right. Okay, so hi, Yana. Hi, Zerkistra. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay. You're welcome. You want to share with us your question? Yes. Uh, like, since 2012, like, everybody talking about this Ascension event. Uh, what's going to happen. Did someone say it's big solar flash or like this uh, moving to 5D? But anyway, what do you think about this ascension? Because they, 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 they say like it might happen this year, like in the spring or at the end of the year. What are your opinion about yeah. that? <clears throat> it's, it's again looking for something from the outside to come and fix me, to come and save me, instead of I look for the source of who I am within myself. I understand, but uh, they said it's certain kind of stuff like going to happen, like with the uh, sun. Is it, what kind of reality is that? <laughs> no one knows. <laughs> <laughs> As I mentioned, you examine the subject, okay? Yeah. All right. Examine the subject. I am the subject, and every experience I have, I have it with an, with an object outside of myself. So if I challenge the subject and go beyond that, what am I going to find? Who is it that is looking for an ascension? Who is it that is looking for a period of time that things go well or are going to be according to my ideas of how they should be, correct? Yes. Talking about an ascension, that we're ascending to a higher level of consciousness, correct? Yes. So how does that happen? Is that a geographical place we're going to go? Are we? No, it's coming inside. Oh, I mean, it's happening inside of mind and heart and this whole kind right. of big shift. Yeah. But is, is this something deal with the sun? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's happening. The ascension is happening right now. The ascension is happening for us worldwide we're dealing with a so-called epidemic that we're dealing with correct and the yes. world is, the, the the world is in fear and some sort of chaos so it looks like it's descending so who's going to ascend out of this the ones but, who, go ahead yeah, yeah, sorry. 
according to uh, you know other sources, this is the first time ascension when we're ascending with our physical body compared to other ascended masters. Who, okay. Uh, and and like I, I I just trying to put this whole thing together, <laughs> you right. know. Because you know you're trying to understand it with your mind. You're, you're trying to figure it out with your analytical mind that from this position of me, what's going to happen for me? How is this going to benefit me? Because all of it is coming to basically me. Am I going to live a better life? Am I going to ascend to a higher consciousness? So there is still this subject that I mentioned. You remember earlier? Yes. There's a subject is seeking an object. The object is a place, ascending to a place. The subject wants to get to a place. Now, what I'm saying is start to challenge this me this idea of me wanting to ascend to this other place. I understand. Yeah, see if this one is real. And then you may discover that that ascension you are seeking for is to get rid of the one who wants to find it. And then you may find yourself ascended. It makes sense. <clears throat> yeah. Just give it a try. I'm not saying you should agree with what I'm saying. I'm not saying you should buy what I say. I'm just simply suggesting to you that maybe it's time to get rid of the one who wants to get somewhere. And then we discover that there's nowhere to get and you're already there. Because it looks like this one who's trying to get somewhere is not getting anywhere. That's true. It just keeps buying more crystals and taking more events and doing that da, 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 and then reading more books. And, and it looks like in the other world, the world outside of us, it doesn't look like it's going anywhere nice. It looks like it's more chaotic Probably soon we're going to lose more freedom. Probably very soon we, won't, we will lose our freedom to travel. Probably soon we're going to be forced to be vaccinated or chipped. Probably soon, you know, it, it's, it looks like it. It appears to me. So <clears throat> I'm not looking for salvation or peace out in that in that place because it's not there maybe we want to use everything we're looking at and what is happening maybe it's somewhere inside myself maybe maybe it's time for me to look for it stop looking for it somewhere else and turn my attention inward But it's so much destruction outside. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, my sister. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to help you with. That mm -hmm. bring your attention inwards. You know, uh, if, if I able to share this thing, I don't know if everybody experiencing this or only a few people, but since this whole thing started and, um, you know, like, few times a day you know i have a feeling that like the reality around me just floating so from one thing like i feel <clears throat> i'm sorry i'm real but it's something unreal is going on around and it's like it's it's i never experienced that and i have very analytical mind but i cannot um disregard that because that's that's so obvious to me that something is like like changing you know something is changing the something, whole structure yeah yes something is changing and it's not just out inside of my heart or my mind or my consciousness subconsciousness it's something changing outside like 
the the world and it's not the people but it's it's the um the fragments this fractures of reality it's like just sort of flo floating yes. yes it is it is that's why i say whatever is changing is not real look for that which doesn't change bring your attention towards that which doesn't change and keep your focus on that and ignore whatever is changing thank you if, if you want freedom if you want freedom otherwise you're going to identify with what is changing and that brings suffering you're just going to suffer it's going to be fear worry and anxiety you bring your attention inwards and stay focused stay bring your attention to the source of your thoughts before the thoughts rise and just be quiet spend time every day be quiet sit in silence go for a walk in the nature in silence away from devices practice being quiet and then you will see what happens look forward to connecting with you god bless sending you lots of love and light namaste Thank you.